Hi guys and welcome back to the blog. Today's video is going to be on some of my previous Christmas items and if I can remember where I purchased everything from, I will let you guys know. Now I did use these items in my Christmas decor and if you look at my recent most, uh, most updated video, you will see these items. For example, look at this beautiful snowman guys. Do you wanna call him Frosty the Snowman? I've had this snowman, guys, probably about three years. He is about two and a half feet tall, close to three feet tall. And I know for a fact that he came from QVC. I don't know if you can still purchase him, but guys, he is the cutest little thing. And like I said, if you watch the Christmas blog that I did um, for YouTube, you'll see him there. So that's our snowman there. And then if we turn this way, guys, you see this on the floor here? Isn't that pretty? That is a snow Christmas bulb, the snow Christmas bulb. And you see, just like the snowman, this lights up as well. And this came from QVC about four years ago, guys. All right? Let's see, what else do we have in here? You guys already seen this. I've already talked to you about that. So we're gonna turn this way and view the Merry Christmas pillow right there. Yes, that is a country door find there. All right, and then we're gonna swing toward the table, guys. Now let me let you peek this way. There is a red pillow back here. This is just a pillow cover from Amazon. Yes, and I'm going to use this in my um, New Year decor because like I explained to you guys, New Year is our anniversary, all right? All right, now on the table, right here is pieces of my stemware. You see the stemware? I have the little red dots in it, and then this one has a red bottom, and then the other one over here has a red markings on them. These Oh my God, these pieces are so old, guys. They were purchased from Pier 1 probably about 10 years ago. Yes, but I keep them in a cabinet, right? And I just bring them out, you know, when I'm doing little things like blogs or when it's our anniversary or when we just want to, you know, just drinking something, I think, cute. So these items here, the stemware came from Pier 1. Now, the little red reindeers here that are on both of the candles. Let me walk you over. There's the other one. These were Walmart finds, guys. Yes. And if you remember, if you remember, guys, I also had the silver ones right here on the tree. Remember? All right. So, that's that. Now, this is so funny. Can you remember the story I told you guys in reference to my husband having to replace a set of rain, red reindeers? Well, this is the replacement set. The original set was kind of like a burgundy wine color. They were so pretty. But when they got broken, you know, I'm sitting here and I was, you know, upset and a little hurt and a little disappointed. So he went back to Home Depot and said, hey, you have any more of those reindeers? The guy said, no, not the like burgundy ones, but we do have some of the red ones. So he purchased the red ones. So these are from Home Depot, guys. Now, here's where the problem come in. This is my little Christmas sled. You see it, guys? And it's actually, it actually holds a Christmas tree. That's the way it was purchased and created. I can't remember where this sled came from, guys. I just can't. But you know what? I will find out for you. And I will definitely put it in the description box. Just in case somebody like it, you know, and may be interested in maybe having one like this. You know, for maybe one of their um, videos or just to decorate their house during the holiday season. All right. So, I think that's everything that's on the table. Oh, except for the plate mats. The red or burgundy plate plate mats. Um, Those came from at home. Yes. And they, they're pretty old, guys. They've probably been around about four or five years now, you know. All right. So, I think that's it in the living room area, guys. So we're gonna swing around. Now, if you notice the fireplace that's in the living room area, 
poinsettias, artificial poinsettias everywhere. There's two here. I'm going to turn this curve, and there's some right there on my staircase, okay? So, when we back up again, those artificial poinsettias came from Home Depot. We purchased those two years ago, and I think we probably bought about six of them. They were so pretty, and I'm like, you know what? We don't have to worry about you know, buying live poinsettias and then they die right after Christmas or before Christmas. So let's just pick up some of these artificial poinsettias and that's what we did. On the fireplace right here, this Christmas wreath came from Country Door. And it is pretty. The poinsettias that are on the Christmas wreath are burgundy. Beautiful guys. And then down here, guys, you see the Christmas box? That's a Christmas box. That item came from QVC as well. You see how it's pretty? It's just lit up. It is so pretty, guys. But And that, you know, is the fireplace area there. Now, I'm going to kind of go up. In another video, guys, here we go again. I talked to you guys about the Nutcracker. Well, there he is. That's the one that got all of my money that particular day. He was like $1.99, guys, and I probably had about $2.30 in my purse that day. But we've had him now for about four, maybe five years, okay? And then let's go this way, guys. You've been in this part of the house, but I just want to show you the items that I didn't talk to you about that I'm sure that you saw in the video. Look at that little lantern. Isn't that cute, guys? And here's the thing that I love about it. Let me get the remote, guys. It changes colors, pink, yellow, purple. It's supposed to turn, okay, green. Uh, there's a blue. So it changes colors, guys. And that's what I like about it so much. But since it's the holiday season, I just keep it on the red, guys. That is super cute, right? All right, now you guys, didn't see the little hat here. It's called the snowman top hat. Yes, isn't that cute? And I think he came from QVC as well. And then there's just a little pillow. Oh, that is so cute. It's an old pillow. He's not torn or broken, guys. He just does this. Okay, see? So he's good. He's in good shape. He just does that. All right, now this right here was just so sad. Mr. and Mrs. Santa Claus, I've had them for 20 years, guys. Yes, 20 years. And guess what happened? <laughs> I went to light them up and they didn't come on. So they stopped working. They worked for 19 years. And this year they would not come on. So, you know what I said? It's okay. They still make a nice, you know, um, addition to our decor. So I just set them out here anyway, guys. All right. Now we're going to swing, let's see, this way. Now let me explain this to you guys. My kitchen was done for my grandbabies, okay? So it doesn't look like the, oh, make a fancy kitchen. No. The kitchen is where we eat and live and hang out besides the family room and we the kids mess up. Because remember, I have, what, 10 grandkids? Yes. So think about it. When they're here, they're eating popcorn and they're just doing whatever they want to do. So let's go visit what I did for them for the kitchen. It's nothing fancy, but it's just cute enough for kids. So let's go. All right, we're heading into my kitchen, guys. And the first thing we're going to visit is the table. Um, I tried to cut the light off so that you can see, but the house is not lit up. It's lit up. It's just too bright in here for you to see it. But this is the table decor for the kids. And what we have here, that's the little Santa jar that I was telling you guys about in another video. Yes, and where did the Santa jar come from? That is a country door find right here. You see this little, I just say Santa's body. <laughs> a little Santa's body, but no, it's actually like a, a candy dish. And that's what I did. I just put candy on the inside of Santa's boots. You see it? Right here is a Courtney check find. So 
that's something else we'll have to talk about in another video. I love Courtney Check, and I have several pieces in our kitchen area, but we'll discuss that in another video. All right, right here, my daughter gave me the ho 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 for Christmas. She works um, part time at a store, and every time they have something that comes in, she'll call me, Mom, they got some new little cute pieces in for Christmas. Do you want anything? I'm like, Sure. Pick out what you want me to have and bring it to me, or I'll come and get it. So the ho 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 came from my daughter. And you've already seen the um, gingerbread trees. And I think you've seen the little gingerbread house here. Look how adorable, though, guys. Isn't that adorable? That is absolutely adorable, guys. And right here, you remember I showed you guys the little, um, I call it the peppermint cake plate. Well, all I did was put some candies on it. And my daughter gave me this little piece here. It's a little boy on one side. I don't want to turn it and mess up the candies, but I don't care. It's okay, because I want you to see it. And on the other side, it's a little girl. Isn't that cute, guys? That is so cute. And that was given to me by my daughter. And back here, we just have some um, snowman platters. That's it. And I'll back up so you can get a... Maybe I'll cut the light on for you guys. Let's do that. Oh, it didn't make a big of a difference. Sorry about that. But right here, these plates on the table, these were Dollar Tree finds probably about three, four years ago. And I was up in the cabinet. I was in the cabinet on the um, other side of the kitchen. And I'm like, oh, my goodness, I have some Christmas plates. So I pulled them out, guys, and I just decided to use them on the table. But this is our kitchen table, guys. Yes, and this is where the kids, you know, sit and eat and make a mess and draw and whatever else they want to do. I don't know. Homework, you know, whatever. We just move these things out the way and let them just have their way. Now, I did create a little small um, cocoa bar, but it's just for the kids, guys, once again. So, here it is. All right. I had a cabinet um, that was just sitting and I took the cabinet and I painted it black, guys. You see it? Now, see up under the bottom, that's just packs of cocoa. And those are for my um, for my carrot right there. And those are straws for the children. But right here, all I did, I just put that little Santa there that we talked about. And the little mugs. And then I had that little cocoa um, little canister there. And then that's my little mini coffee pot. And that's my curate right there. And I just made the kids a little small coffee bar there. All right? And then right here, let me back up, back up. Right here on the door are my Christmas bells that you didn't get a chance to see either. Yeah, those are my Christmas bells, guys. And I think they're the cutest little things. You guys remember I painted this kitchen, right? Well, I did 99.9% .9 of it, but it's okay. But, yeah. This and those are guys, and you know, I was talking to you guys about my husband putting a shelf in the kitchen windowsill for my plants. Well, guys, there is my shelf there. There is the shelf. I think he did a pretty good job, don't you? Yeah, he did. And we're gonna back up. We're gonna back up. We're gonna back up. Hope I don't fall. Pray that I don't fall. And I wanted to get you guys to this area right here right here now there is that piece guys i know you guys was probably wondering where was i where was i going to put the piece but i put it in my kitchen let me back up and there it is there's that piece guys and i have it on for you so it is lit up you see it it's lit up and over here there's another little lantern and right there guys are little pumpkin peppermints <laughs> little pumpkin peppermint Pumpkin is all I can say, but since they were peppermint, I brought them out, okay? Those black and white um, salt and pepper shakers are Courtney Check, and like I said, we'll talk about that later, guys, because I have a lot of it in the kitchen. And right here is another little frosted peppermint stick. I just thought that was the cutest little thing, guys. So, yeah, um, we're in my kitchen, and that's the little decor here. Now, um, I'm going to give you a little, show you a little something here because, you know, I talked to you guys and told you that I love to collect fat men. Well, here are some of my fat men. Huge, 
humongous, big, spacious, fat men. Yes. And if I go back this way, you may can see some of the other ones. I just have a Christmas item up there, too. But I have a lot of fat men. And I have some fat ladies, fat women. Fat ladies. <laughs> Whatever you want to call them, right? But anyway, yeah, I just wanted to show you guys those pieces. And I guess you can see the majority of everything is in my kitchen is red. Because I told you guys I love red. So I'm going to show it to you. Now, these are the items that are always out because these are the items that we use. I'm always trying to bake my husband something. Um, I love my fat man. So you see he's holding two bottles of wine. That is for, there's my ninja because I have a smoothie every day and we certainly use that air fryer. The air fryer is pink because I purchased it for breast cancer awareness, guys. Yes. And then if I swing this way a little bit, there is my gingerbread cookie guy right there, guys. You see him? And my daughter gave me the little Santa girl. Yes. All right. So that's, those are the items that are in my kitchen area. Okay, so what I want to do now, I want to take you guys out. And I'm going to take you, I ask permission, guys, take you to Kasaya's room. Because I want to show you guys, um, I had purchased some purple curtains for the... Um, living room when I was doing the Christmas video, but I didn't put them up guys. So they ended up in Kasaya's room. Okay, this is Kasaya's room. You see these curtains guys? These are the curtains that I had purchased to use for my Christmas video, but I end up not using them. So you know what? I was looking around. I said, you know what? They match Kasaya's bed spread perfectly guys. Let me show you. Okay. See, they start out one color and then they they gradually get darker. You see that? They get darker. Now, let's take a look at Kasaya's bed. You look at her spread. She's in school, guys. See where it starts out light and it gets darker and then it gets really dark. You guys know, I explained to you guys that purple is Kasaya's favorite color. And this is, this is her little room. That's her bed. Yeah, that's her beauty bar that I'm always talking to you guys about. She's always talking about my beauty, my beauty bar, you know. And then she have a desk and she have a little chair in her room and her television and stuff. But yeah, this is Kasai's room. And I painted her room, guys. Woo, I was tired. But I was determined to get these walls painted. Her room has been painted um, lilac for probably three years now, but I painted it. And last year, I kind of touched it up a little bit because she, she just turned 12. So every now and then, she touched walls. She does things like any other kid would do. But I came back and I touched painted her wall probably, I don't know, about a year maybe ago. But this is Kasaya's bedroom. And that's Kasaya's little desk in her workstation. And this is her room, guys. But, yeah, I just wanted to show you the curtains that were supposed to go in the living room with the Christmas decor. They ended up in my baby's room, making her room look better, guys. So, welcome to Kasaya's room, guys. All right, guys. Is that it? I think that, no, it's one more item. But we're not going to worry about that. It's just some large, oversized lanterns. They're red. Um... We'll go back. They're red. And we'll go back up my hallway. Excuse my husband's jackets. We'll go back up and we'll peek down and I'll show you those lanterns. All right. And I'm going to go down so you can see them. They're the lanterns. Aren't they beautiful? I think Valerie may be on QVC or HSN, but it's designed by Valerie. These are some of the lanterns that she, you know, creates. And I have a black one up high, but it's not cut on. But there's a black one. And like I said, those are the red ones, the burgundy red ones there. And um, that's it, guys. So now everything that is a part of our Christmas decor, not my Christmas decor, but our Christmas decor has been seen. And what I'm going to do, I will... Put everything in the description box for you guys. Make it easy so that you can find some of these items if you're interested and if you like them. So thank you so much for stopping by, guys. I appreciate you so much. I love you as a person. I do. I love you. And I want God to continue to bless all of us. And 
we do anything wrong, we say anything wrong, ask God to forgive us. One more thing, guys, I really need your support. You see your girl is over here working hard trying to make this happen for us. So I need you guys to go in. Please go in. Help me out. Please click the like. Leave a nice comment, guys. It doesn't take a second. Just for a second to leave a comment. Just say something nice for me. Um, subscribe to my channel if you have not. If you're just kind of browsing and you like what you see, subscribe to my channel. Hit the notification button so you won't miss an upload. And do me one more thing. If you can, if you have the time, share the video. I know people are busy. I know people are working. I know people are shopping. I know that we're trying to get things in order around our homes. So, guys, thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you so much for your kindness and your goodness. And I appreciate you, and I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys.